Hey friends, thanks for checking out PRM. I came across some interesting poll data uh, from a 2017 Gallup poll that said 42% of the electorate are registered independents, 29% are registered Democrats, and 27% are registered Republicans. One more time. Independents are 42% of the entire electorate. 29% Democrats, 27% Republicans. Someone tell me why Bernie isn't running as an independent. He needs to run as an independent. He has it locked up already, going on that data alone. And if you want to dig into the data a little bit more, there's a sizable, a sizable portion of that 29% of Democrats who support in favor Bernie Sanders and his policies. So that 42% is actually bigger. Um, and let's, let's go down a little bit further. One in 10 Trump voters back in 2016 were gonna, would have voted for Bernie Sanders. One in 10. So Bernie has this locked up, okay? He has the independent vote, that's for damn sure. He has a chunk of the Dems and he has a chunk of the Republicans. Someone tell me why he shouldn't run as an independent. Because what happened in 2016 with the Democrats was an utter tragedy. And we need to avoid that at all costs for 2020. Because, talk about a screw job. And just, we don't need the Democrats. I don't need to merge with Democrats who are conservative in nature, who are conservative in, in economics, and, you know, don't hold my progressive values. I, I've been trying to, like, find my niche in the resistance. You know, I even named this channel Progressive Resistance Media, and I've been trying to make a, an edge, a, a hedge, a push towards, um, you know, trying to make myself a Democrat, trying to impose progressivism uh, onto the Demo Democratic Party, and it's not working. It didn't work in 2016. I do not foresee it happening in 2020 either. So here's the thing. The data shows Bernie's going to win as an independent. He's going to steal votes from the Dems. He's going to steal votes from the GOP. Let's run him as an independent. Let's get the word out. I know you're saying, I'm just one person, Dave. What can I do? Well, it's online. So you're going to be reaching a lot more people and this isn't a one-on-one -on -one thing. So, so don't, don't sell yourself short in what you can accomplish here. This is grassroots. This is a grassroots operation. No one's going to take us by the hand and say, oh, okay, uh, we're, we're going we're to add Bernie into you know, the Democratic platform and all that, yada, yada. No, we got to make this happen on every single level possible, uh, locally, you know, online, and, 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 and word of mouth, because... Everybody has shunned Bernie. The establishment has shunned him and our movement, and we need to move around them. And we have the data, we have the stats to prove he can win, and we just got to get him to run as an independent somehow. We got we to gotta make everybody aware of this. So get your social media pages up going, start a YouTube channel, do something that's going to launch this movement to the sun, uh, because it's not going anywhere. Uh, so... So, so get involved. It's okay to get involved. I know you're just one person, but you are more than that. You can reach so many people, especially online. So don't sell yourself short. Okay, uh, leave a comment, uh, like, and subscribe.